All right, guys, here we go. Let's go ahead and put the ingredients together. I don't even need this. That's for outside. Take that over here. And we're going to get the ingredients together to go ahead and inject the turkey with the turkey injector here. Set that off to the side there. And I will put the ingredients list in the description here for you guys. What you're going to need is a full stick of butter right here. You're going to need six tablespoons of soy sauce here. You're going to need three teaspoons of Old Bay. And that's basically everything you're going to need for now. Make sure you get yourself one of these injectors uh, for the turkey. We go ahead and combine the ingredients into a pan. So I'll take the whole stick of butter right here. Put it into the pan. All right, three teaspoons of soy sauce. Got the low sodium here for the win. Three teaspoons of Old Bay. Go ahead and put this on medium here. And mix everything up a little bit. You want to go ahead and bring this to a simmer here. I'm going to go ahead and prepare our lemon here. Go ahead and uh, cut your lemon in half. You're going to use the lemon to go ahead and put that on the bird. Okay, the mixture is simmering here, about to come to a boil. We'll go ahead and turn that off. You want to let that cool. And that's the mixture you're going to be injecting into the bird. So let's go ahead and get the bird ready. Alright guys, here is the bird. Go ahead and take the goodies out. Alright guys, go ahead and take the bag out here. Into the pan. Alright guys, your mixture should have cooled off by now, so just take your injector and inject this in about eh, 10 to 12 places. And until this is all gone here. Alright guys, take some of your olive oil. Put it on the bird here. Along with some salt and pepper. On the one side. Take half your lemon, put that lemon juice on here. Yeah. Go ahead and rub everything in now. Alright, now flip your bird over. Repeat the process on this side with the rest of the ingredients here in the pan. Take your olive oil. Put it on the bird. Repeat with the salt and pepper on this side. Simply rub it into the bird. I take the other half of your lemon lemon juice all over that bird. Alright guys, one final thing before you add this. Now, this is going on the grill. 
you want to go ahead and fill this up a good amount with uh, some chicken broth here. It's about half of this 32 ounce container here. Okay, onto the grill she goes. Alright, we got a big cup of mesquite chips that we've been soaking overnight. Go ahead and add about half of this right off the bat here. How we got this set up is we got charcoal on both sides. All right, close her up. And don't touch it for about an hour. See you then. All right, about an hour later, this is what it looks like. Let's go ahead and turn this thing. It's not required to turn it because of the design of this grill, but why not? All right, go ahead and baste this here. All right, let this sit for another hour. Wow! All right, and then after two hours, it's time to go ahead and flip the bird. And go ahead and add the rest of your wood chips here. And there we go. Definitely takes some effort to flipping a 20 pound bird. Okay guys, this is three hours later. Let's go ahead and take a temperature reading three hours later and just see where we're at with this. Okay, so it does need a little bit more time. All right, guys, here we are, four hours later. All right, I think we're good.